Yo, what is going on guys, I'm back with another video. Today I am on Rune Realm and I will be doing a server showcase on the server. Now before we get into that, I just want to announce a beautiful giveaway of one epic donator chest. There will be one lucky winner winning this epic donator chest. All you have to do to enter the giveaway is make sure you are subscribed, make sure to turn on notifications, make sure to like the video and comment your in-game name down below. The winners will be picked in just about two days. As always, they will be announced in my community discord, in the server's discord and on my pinned comment. The links of discords are down down below in description so definitely make sure you join those so when you create the, an account on this server you actually have the option between eight different game modes as you can see right here the normal four game modes like iron man hardcore iron man and ultimate but then they also have extreme regular account extreme iron man extreme hardcore iron man and extreme ultimate iron man basically the extreme version gives you a lot less experience rates than the normal version so if you are up for the challenge definitely make sure to try this out i will go ahead and create a normal account for now accept this real quick now if you type con con ref in game you'll be able to click youtube and then you will be able to click noobs own and you will get yourself a nice little additional reward so the home area is a nice little custom map as you can see you have basically all the features that you need you have skilling you have all the shops around here you have the altars where you can switch around your magic spell book and prayers uh, besides that you have even more shops at the other side and then of course wood cutting here as well you also have a little well of goodwill in the middle where you can go ahead and donate to for some server wide boosts besides that you have a few implings flying around here that you can go ahead and catch for some herb lord experience and then of course right here you have a fishing spot as well making this a perfect functional home area for the average killer you can basically do any skill you want at the home area now another feature that I like a lot about this custom RSPS is besides the regular home teleport in your magic book you also have the ability to teleport to donator zones. Now each donator zone is custom and has its own benefits for example the regular donator zone right here. This has a few slayer monsters if you go a bit further as you can see right there. Um, this also has a blood rune crafting altar besides that you have an infinite wood cutting tree that you basically can afk on um, and you also get a 20 percent experience boost on anything you do in the zone besides that you have the super donator zone now this zone is a little upgrade you have crystal npcs right here like crystal demons avncs dragons and so on these will actually drop pvp armors which is pretty cool you also have infinite mining rocks right here um, and also the trees and this will give you a 30% skilling bonus overall you also have this nice little boss portal which will lead you to a boss besides that you have the sponsor zone right here now the sponsor zone has a daily chest that you can go ahead and claim every 24 hours you can also go ahead and right click this to examine it and then you will be able to see the drop table from this um, chest that you can loot every single day and as you can see you can get some insane rewards from these if you get lucky enough to hit the rare drop table now besides that you have this chalice right here now this chalice provides you with a regeneration and a free overload boost which is really nice you also have a custom ZMI rune crafting altar right here um, which only does useful higher level runes I think that is really cool and in the whole zone you get a 40% skilling experience boost besides that you still have the super sponsor zone this zone is also really cool you have a bunch of custom features right here as well I'm not going to go over all of these and then you have the elite sponsor zone once again has a bunch of custom features now currently there is a random um, NPC that can come up to you and give you a cake and that cake will let you teleport to this zone so currently even if you don't have donator rank you will be able to access this zone and loot yourself that daily treasure which is absolutely amazing also every 30 minutes there is a world or a global event for example this experience event that is going on right now the server needs to get a total of 30 million experience and if you participate you will be able to get yourself an event key or even if you are lucky a superior event key that can then be used right here at the chest at the home area and if you examine it you can see that this chest will be able to give you a bunch of really sick loots as well so once there is an event going on definitely make sure you participate in it to get yourself a chance at getting one of these sick rewards now you also have this cool little npc right here at the home area basically once you reach a level 99 you can go ahead and prestige your skill you can do this up to 10 times and once you have prestiged 10 times you have the mastery prestige 
Um, besides that, every prestige also gets boosts. You get a um, untrimmed skill cape once you reach level 99 the first time. If you prestige and reach another level 99, you will get yourself the trimmed skill cape and then moving on, if you prestige a bunch of times, you'll get the mastery skill cape. Now you also get points that you can spend right here at the ability store. Basically, if you would prestige every skill to the max 10 times basically, um, you will get a total of 660 prestige po points. The owner has um, done that to my account so I can showcase that. Basically the prestiges or the um, perks that you can actually go ahead and buy. For example, the Berserker right here, which will give me 10% boost to accuracy and strength versus monsters. So that is really nice. Definitely going to go ahead and unlock that. And as you can see right there, I have that unlocked now, which is really cool. Anyways, there is also a wiki page on Rune Realm Wiki where you can go ahead and find the perks table now this will actually showcase all the boosts that you will get from each single skill with their untrimmed trimmed and mastery cape version so if you want to check that out for yourself definitely make sure to check out the rune realm wiki now if you manage to get a master prestige skill cape or a prestige master cape if you have completed all the prestiges you will be able to teleport to the prestige guild now this guild is very nice because it gives you a 20 percent experience boost while skilling however if you climb up the stairs all the way to the top floor you will have this afk zone in this afk zone you can basically go ahead and afk um, whatever you want right here for example use this exercise mat now as you probably already have seen i have custom armor on because the server also, of course also has custom armor set uh, for example upgradable and degradable um, pvp armor sets you have to have three pieces of the same tier in order to upgrade it to the next tier and this way you can go ahead and create it all the way up to the tier 5 which is what I have on right now and that has absolutely amazing stats as you can see a 180 strand bonus that is absolutely amazing now besides that you also have a few custom armor sets like this the ninja armor set the kyodo armor set and also a samurai armor set these are basically three different versions one will be for magic one for range and one for melee um, they both uh, they all increase your attack speed and you can buy all of these sets for blood money in the blood money store um, so yeah ninja is of course for magic then you have kyodo for range and then the samurai for melee now you also have this little cool custom set right here, the Ethereal set. Now this set is actually really cool, especially in the wilderness, because this will give you 40% um, reduced damage of NPCs in the wilderness. And you will also have 10% from players in the wilderness, also a decent prayer bonus together with this armor. As you can see, I have a 31 prayer bonus right there, so that is absolutely amazing. Now you can obtain this through the custom Ethereal Revenant boss. Um, so yeah, if you want to go for that set, definitely make sure to check out that boss in game. Now there are also a bunch of custom pets in game with a bunch of cool features. For example, the Hydra pet right here has the bank option. So anywhere I go with this pet, I'll have the ability to check out my bank. If I am bossing, I can just go ahead and re-gear with food and bank my loot. That is absolutely insane in my opinion. Every single NPC also has, or every single pet, I mean, has its own different bonuses that you can check out. So definitely make sure to do that in game. Now for the gambling zone, if you type colon colon gamble in game, you'll be teleported to the gambling zone. Now I want to showcase this because they have some interesting features in here. Now this is located in the Feldor party room. You also have the actual party room available so you can put in uh, things in the chest and then you'll have the party balloons dropping. You can gamble here with automatic flower poker and stuff but the main thing right here is if you place bets with bookie you can bet on one of these three terror birds and they will actually do a race so let's go ahead and bet on green for example i'm going to bet 10 million it will take 30 seconds so people can also participate and place their bets so let's go ahead and see what this ends up with so here we go the race is about to start let's see if green can pull us the win as you can see the terror birds will be racing versus each other i think this is absolutely amazing i love that they implemented this uh, but i am losing right now green pull it together man blue is leading heavily and then red is following right on his tail but blue is the winner which means i lost my 10 mil gp unfortunately besides that you have the gambler right here rune draw is a mini game that is still being added you will be able to place your bets later on for now it is just for fun so if i draw a rune i get points based on those runes and i have to try to get to 21 i believe like blackjack uh, without crossing it now you can also 
yeah i'm gonna hold this you can also get death runes which means you will instantly die uh, but unfortunately i lost hit as well now if you like a custom storyline this server actually has three fully custom quests um, they wrote this completely from scratch, only um, Resign for Disaster is based on the original one. However, it takes place in a different map and the storyline is a little bit adjusted. It's only boss fights as well, so you don't have to do any talking. Uh, besides that, you have the Ancient Barbarians quest. Now, this will be needed to unlock um, Ancient Barbarian bosses, which are custom bosses. They have different styles, like the Drag Dagonaut Kings, and they each drop one shard to combine into a fatal blade which is a custom type katana sword now basically here is the quest line you can check all of that out in game for me it is already completed and you can see the rewards from each and these uh, of these quest lines as well now the creepers in the crevice is used to unlock alchemical hydra as a boss so that is also really nice if you are able to unlock that because of course you can get this pet which will let you bank anywhere also you have this little panel right here which will be able to showcase you a bunch of things you can like open up your collection log for example and for anyone who knows i love the collection log on any server it is for me a really big motivation to grind out pvming stuff so as you can see right there, the collection log will give you the ability to check out all the rare drops that you can get from certain bosses. Also, if you already have gotten them as a drop or not. Um, we also have mini games right here. For example, the Chambers of Xerix, of course, because they also have raids added into this game. They also have the Recep for Disaster mini game, which can give you a bunch of pets and then, of course, battles as well. You can check out your clue rewards if you are lucky enough to get one of these super rare items. And then you also have a bunch of other custom chests and mystery boxes, for example that you can check out if you have the rare loot already go now this server still has so much more to offer but you'll have to check all of that out for yourself in game because there is just way too much content to actually go over in this one video also recently they just added something new which is prop hunt for people who don't know the owner can then hide into a certain object and can then hide around the map if you examine him you will be announced to the winner he is actually doing that on a live stream right now which is really cool and then as you can see scuba has found me is what will be announced for the player if they find him as first and then you will of course get yourself a reward so i think that is a really cool addition for a custom mini game that they can do to host like a few giveaways for you guys here and there i haven't seen it on any other server before so i think that makes it even more unique so definitely make sure to hop on in game and try to participate in this for yourself anyways that is where i will be ending off today's video guys i hope you guys did enjoy this video if you did make sure to smash the like button subscribe if you didn't already also make sure to enter the giveaway and i'll be catching you guys in my next video peace